and gals okay so we're gonna be doing something different and I haven't recorded in a while so I look a hot mess plus I'm outside painting so that doesn't give you a little indication of what we're gonna be doing but I'm gonna do like a little vlog type thing I guess for this project because I'm gonna be doing a larger canvas which I've just recently started doing since we've been stuck at home and thankfully they did have like all the art surprises on sale so I was like okay cool and yes that's why you also hear a lot of background noise because I'm outside but we're going to be turning this lovely plain kind of big white canvas into some kind of piece of art I don't know what yet but I figured I'd take y'all on this journey with me right now I'm just gonna be covering the whole thing black so I'm gonna be spray painting everything black and then we'll move on to whatever next step I decide <laughs> but for right now we're gonna paint the entire thing black and then I think I'll catch up with y'all once I get ready to put an actual design on here and I actually I have to go to the store and get some more paint so Right now, we're just going to do everything black. Okay, so it's been a couple days. I had to get some more spray paint. So now we are going to finish doing the background. And I'm just using some spray paint I got from Walmart so and I decided what I'm finally gonna do with this I'm gonna try and do a galaxy I've never done a spray paint galaxy before so we're gonna try this
Okay, so at some point the camera stopped recording, so I'm not sure how much you've seen at this point because I just got done. But this is the finished product, and I think for my first one, it didn't turn out too terribly bad. I thought it was going to be a lot worse. So yeah, that is my first attempt at doing a spray paint piece of art. I hope y'all enjoyed this, is, you know, depending on how much is actually recorded. Okay, so hopefully y'all got to see a good bit of the process. Like I said, I'm just starting to learn how to do like spray paint art. So this was my first like big piece that I did. And then after this, I've done quite a few other pieces and only one of them do I deem like any remotely kind of sellable. If I, you know, I don't really sell my art because I'm not confident whatsoever about selling my art. But um, I think I have one piece that I'm willing to at least attempt to sell. So there's that. But this was like the very, very first one. So I doubt I'm getting rid of it even if it didn't have any flaws on it. Because it does have, see mainly where I was right here trying to do this star, it messed up on me and it would have looked kind of cute if it hadn't had this big gap in there right here where i let the paint build up too much and it just it messed up so that was my bad but other than that i think everything came out pretty good with it plus i had to clear coat it so the one i showed you in the in the film it didn't get clear coated but yes i think it cut out like as i was doing all of this right here and this part up here it kind of cut out <laughs> as I was doing that and then I didn't get to show you the reveal for the planets and I was kind of sad because that was that for me is whenever I can finally take the stuff off and show the planets that is like my biggest my biggest thing so I love I love seeing that but um I'm probably gonna do a few more since I've started getting into this and maybe it will help somebody else because like I said I am a complete beginner so here we go. Let's just put it behind. It's like, a, what is it? The, uh, God, I just lost where it was. Not boom. Yeah, boom boxes. Like it used to be from the 80s. I'm just gonna do that one thing. But, yes. Like I said, everything turned out pretty good. Plus, I know I've got to get a table because I do this outside in my driveway and I have to squat down the whole time. And let me tell you, girl is out of shape for that. <laughs> But other than that, this came out really well aside from, and it being my first one, I thought it was gonna turn into like a giant blob, to be quite honest, so. And I learned a lot when I made this. I also learned very quickly the difference between a cheap paint and good paint. Because this, where I did the stars and stuff, it was kind of cheap paint, so it doesn't look as nice as when I finally did go back and get some good white paint and they look 10 times better. Okay, that little piece right here, we're just gonna tuck right right there. Just do it like that. But <laughs> it's been raining, so my hair is just in my hair is a mess. But um, plus I was at work earlier, so again, my hair is a mess. But I hope y'all like this. Like I said, I don't know if I'm gonna put these up in the shop to sell or anything because I don't know how to do the shipping on them like the shipping is kind of confusing and i'm only being able to get to the post office i think once a week if i do have orders and stuff to ship so i haven't yet figured out how to ship these so i'm probably just going to do like local stuff right now but if i do some smaller ones i know how to ship those it's just these buggers i don't really know how to ship if i do decide to do the big ones so i'm working on it but that's if anybody even likes them and wants to buy them so <laughs> No pressure, just, you know, but I hope y'all enjoyed that. Like I said, it was kind of new for me and I wanted to share that experience with you. So if you're a beginner doing something like this and maybe you could get some tips and ideas, highly doubt it because you couldn't see much, but like I said, I don't know. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this little vlog, me vlogging, me painting, I guess is what we're going to call this. But like I said, I'm, I'm going to, I have a lot more videos planned and as we progressively get more and more freedom in our world, hopefully, hopefully, you know, I'll be able to get more material, I'll be able to do more stuff, especially I wanted to do a lot more vlogs. So hopefully we can do that as well. Like I said, I have a few things coming for the channel. So be on the lookout for that. And I'm talking with my hands too much. But anyways, like I said, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Let me know down in the comments what you thought. Let me know if you would even buy art because I don't know I always feel weird about that that's just one thing I'm just like you really want to buy my art like really sure <laughs> that's, that's just my main thing I'm not that confident as an artist are, are any artists that confident I mean we're, we're our worst critics but 
I will see y'all in the next video. I hope y'all have a lovely day. Like I said, I hope everybody is doing well. Let me know down in the comments how you are, how you're coping, and how you're dealing with this mess if you're still stuck at home. We finally did go back to work, so yay on that. Hopefully it stays that way. But like I said, I need to keep quit saying that. We can take shots for how many times I say that right now. I'm going to end this video. It's starting to get weird. But I will see y'all in the next one. Thank you so much, guys. Bye.